guys, how are you doing? It already got a bit later today, but we have the A45S with us, actually with the Aero Kit, and we want to do the acceleration run using the drift box on the open autobahn. Later also means, of course, there's less traffic and we can maybe even do a top speed run with this car. So what is actually the benchmark for this car? Actually, my personal benchmark is our own Audi RS3 that we owned about a year ago. Of course, it's a bit unfair because that was a pre OPF model uh, which has of course more than 400 horsepower likely more than 400 horsepower and it has the sedan shape which means it's more aerodynamic um, on the autobahn will probably have a better 100 to 200 time than this um, hatch uh, A45S with the aero kit that means has the big rear wing and of course that produces drag so I'm not expecting a 100 to 200 time which is better but let's see if the time to 100 is actually similar to what the RS3 did and in what regard we were getting we put it in race of course not sport plus but race we put it in the sport handling mode we don't need let's say fully traction control off so we want to keep it safe and let's head out Now see how fast it goes from 100 to 200. I guess we did some pretty amazing times. I was not expecting that this car is actually in the same league as our previous generation RS3. As sad because of reasons of aerodynamic and of course because of this car having an OPF and having the latest regulations to meet. We actually managed a time of 3.7 seconds. Actually 3.8 says the drift box, 3.7 says the internal measurement system and of 9.1 and actually 9.4 if you do a rolling start without the launch control and those harsh gear shifts 100 200 which is actually on the drift box there and this one shows half a tenth let's say slower which equals to a 12.9 0 to 200 13 uh, seconds here 0 to 200 which is more or less exactly the time that we managed to do with our own rs3 pre opf with a lot of horsepower well broken in with that glorious five cylinder with the sedan shape that means that this car really has some serious performance because it performs in a very very similar way as the RS3 did and considering the fact that this could be even a CLA 45S which would be more aerodynamic I would even say that this is a bit faster than our RS3 if this one with the aero kit is already in the same league so I didn't expect that I was expecting it to be slower also, 100 to 200 time, I mean, you have to imagine that this hatch with the arrow in the back has a faster time 100 to 200 than a BMW M4 competition of the outgoing model. So that is really serious autobahn performance, not only track performance. And you probably all know that on a racetrack, of course, this thing is going to destroy any of the other competitors because it got a rear biased all-wheel drive system. And yeah, it's, let's say, very, very agile also from a chassis perspective. Um, yeah, we will have more fun with the car on the country roads of course pure sound video is also going to go live very very soon so please check out all the content also those new reels that we're doing on instagram really looking forward to your comments